Uzana diri Ezenke bube Onye nani ya na chieze Luwe biye bi Ndi mozi nina Ana bisi ala nye Ana sinso kaji yova mdi Upon the rock, Jesus I stand All of the ground is sinking sand All of the ground is sinking sand Hallelujah Welcome back wonderful people I hope you guys are doing great as always Glory be to God I welcome you If you are new here You are highly welcome Thank you for tuning in Guys, through the title You know what this video today is talking about Okay Like I said there I was almost initiated Yes Wanting to, but God, you know what? God got my back. Yes, I thank Him for everything. Please, before I go further, okay, I want us to pray so that I commit this video onto the hand of God. I thank God for my life. I thank God for your life also as you are watching me for the grace of seeing today. It is not, I always say, it is not by, by our minds because, yeah, we wish, we desire to be alive. That is why we are alive. No, it's because of God's grace. Okay. Just God choose us to be alive. That is why we are alive today. Guys, this video today, I thank God that I'm finally here to do this. You know one thing, our God is a great reminder. If God wants you to, to do something, I don't know how many of you have had this experience. When God wants you to do something, he will continue to remind you. We continue bringing that to your heart, okay? Every now and then, every minute, every second, that thing will be popping up. It's all you think. Okay, so I said, guys, let me do this video and also go on with other things that uh, I have to do. Okay, because as you can see, my channel, we have not been doing as we're supposed to. But I'm not complaining. There is a because for that. Yeah, there is a reason for that. I, I thank God. Okay, I thank God for everything. So I pray this afternoon that God will take absolute control. I commit this whole time this hour this uh, this apartment i commit everything unto the hand of god mighty jehovah i pray O king of glory that you come oh lord my god come and speak through me father i pray for that unction to function to speak oh lord my god deeply that which you want me to touch that which you want me to say oh lord my god let me say it the way it pleases you and i pray mighty jehovah that no demon no devil no wish no wizard no marine spirit will hold on to my testimony, because this is a testimony. So, Heavenly Father, I pray, Holy Spirit Divine, come and have your way. Come and take control. Speak through me. Direct my words, O King of Glory, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, I pray. Amen. Heavenly Father, I ask for mercy, for I know in one way or the other, I have gone short of thy glory by my actions, my reactions, my unforgiveness, my 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 sins, iniquities, O Lord, my God, transgressions. I pray the precious blood of your son jesus christ to cleanse and renew my spirit amen amen i soak this prayer i soak this video i soak myself my spirit and my soul with the precious blood of jesus christ of nazareth amen amen thank you guys please don't click out okay this is so important. Don't click out. This video is important. Don't click out. Before I go further, I want us to go. I want to read Revelation 12, my Bible here. Revelation chapter 12, 11, okay? Let me go up a bit, okay? Let me go up so that it will make more sense of what I want to say. Ah, uh, then I heard a, vo a loud voice. I heard a loud voice in heaven say, now have come the salvation. Don't mind my, uh, uh, this is uh, life in the spirit. Eh? Sometimes our English here, eh? <laughs> they be one kind, okay? So, but 
by the Holy Spirit. You will understand. Yeah. Now, now have come the salvation and the power and the kingdom of our God and the authority of his Christ for the accuser of our brothers who accuses them before our God day and night has been hauled down. They overcame him by the blood of the lamp and by the word of their testimonies. Okay, I want to testify so that that which God has done, that which God has redeemed me, that which God has saved me from will sink, will continue to manifest and will continue to be concrete and authentic in Jesus' name. Amen. Please, if you like, you will still go back to this, okay? Revelation uh, 12, start from 10, okay? And if you can, go up to all. So, what am I here to say today, my wonderful people? That my experience when I went to Africa last year. Yes, I God, take control. What is that? That you guys know what is happening now. So many things. This, our Christianity, has become a, 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 a mockery, a joke. Yes. People, so many people, I will not say people because there are still believers. There are still die hard in Christ. Yes. But so many now, especially what I witnessed, what I saw when I went to Nigeria, precisely. I'm from Nigeria. If you are watching me and you are not a Nigerian, okay? What I witnessed and what I saw was terrible. That is, I feel like crying. Seeing people going back again to that, which, to that, do I say way, way of life or, yeah, way of life of our forefathers that never brought any good to us, to so many. I don't know about my forefathers. I don't know what they practice, okay? I don't know what they practice, but I know that my dad. As of when I was a little child, my dad is not a Christian. My dad don't go to church, but he will always wake us up every morning, wake us up every morning, every Sunday to go to church and every morning to pray before we prepare for school. He will ask you, Chisoba, go and pray. Uh, go and pray. You people, you guys should pray every morning. But this man, and we also saw him kneel down pray as well and but when he prays he will call uh you know for me hearing that i will i believe that he is not a, a christian because if you are a christian you don't call you understand i believe you only call only god almighty jesus christ you know jehovah shaman jehovah nisi elohim adonai these beautiful names okay but like when I, I went to Africa last year, I, I asked him a question because I saw him going to church. So I now asked him, what about your Chukwabama Binibwe, you know? He said uh, it's the same thing, that one apart. But my, my, what I'm saying is that there are people who maybe in their, in their family, okay, where, what they knew or what they know, is seeing their fathers uh, using maybe white cloth, red cloth, calling some people to the house to come and perform rituals and sacrifices, you know. I've never witnessed this, guys. But I know that when I was a little girl, because uh, they said that I'm a dada, you know, when you when you uh, have a rasta, yeah, dreadlock, all I witnessed, was that my dad used to sometimes my dad will call children buy biscuit fanta coke and all that to do like sacrifice he will say it's for me it's for because i am a dad that, that is the kind of sacrifice i witnessed my dad perform that one aside but what i am saying here is that people so many people who visited me when they came they will be asking me have you have you uh asked where you came from 
did you already know where you came from please guys if this video because i don't want this video to exceed 15 minutes okay there is a reason for that i will continue in my another video it will like have part two because i want to go deep and explain so many things so there will be like have you noticed have you asked of where you came from so that you will be going to to perform rituals like bringing the oh heart god bringing uh the spirit home that is welcoming them okay i said what are you saying at this age and time you are still talking about where you come from uh the spirit where you belong who is uh this or that i don't know if you know what i'm saying i don't know how many of you who have witnessed this I said, what are you guys saying? Okay. Not one person, not two, not three. The person will say, ah, stay there now. You don't know what is happening. You have to, if not, nothing will work for you. Nothing. I said, so all this why are they the one doing, giving me life? Are they the one giving me life or gave me children or gave me husband or provide my food for me? ah forget and when you look at these people guys most of you my friends i am not here to castigate you what your what you believe in i'm a content creator and uh, i am a a testimony okay of god i am a merchandise of christ so uh, my job here is also to testify so share my experience if you go through my channel you see all this so i am not here please don't be offended and take anything i said here personal but i have to share although if you are my friend and you're watching this i've spoken to you very well about this and what i stand for okay so i now said look at your life okay you just want to be like your forefathers because when you check these people are poor these people are poor in spirit physically spiritually they are poor i am not here to cause anybody and whatever we say here no devil no witch or wizard will hold it against me because my word here the word of god here not my word the word of god here in revelation 12 11 10 and 11 okay i've overcome them by the testimony and by what god did on the cross According to Colossians uh, uh, chapter 2, verse 14 and uh, 15. Don't mind me, okay? I'm 10 stop, okay? Don't mind me. But God is taking control. So, guys, it's like a battle. Not one person, not two, not three. Uh -uh. I said, are you guys looking for uh, uh, people you will recruit? Okay? That is what I felt it to be. That these people are looking for people to recruit. And I said, I am not one of them. I know what I did before I stopped my dad from performing those, um, those uh, sacrifices. He said it's for dreadlock people, dada them. What we call it in Igbo is dada. Okay. I know what I battle. And he stopped. So now your friends, they will call you or ask you, ah, sister, send money uh, for us to go for you to bring a, a marine spirit because you belong to water spirits. Okay. Huh. It's not joke. That is why our youths now, some of them, they say they are doing Yahoo and all that. Those things are rituals. They are doing rituals. Not, nothing like Yahoo. Who is a move? Who has even money to throw away? What are they talking? So they now have more sense more than white people to deceive them in what? What do you show them to deceive them to give you that kind of money that they say that the, 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 the Yahoo pay them? I don't believe that. So many things are going wrong. So many just because of these things. I call them poor because 